Hi, hey everybody. Today I'm here with Brett Phillips. Great, great guy. Probably one of the smartest guys I know when it comes to uh, real estate oh, and e EXP. Um, and I just wanted to kind of do a little interview with him today. We are, we're brothers here at EXP and I wanted to ask him a few questions so that I can learn and maybe some of the people out there in Facebook land um, and all over the investment world can learn a little bit more about EXP. Yeah. So tell me a little bit about their insurance program because, uh, you know, I, I, I'm interested to know about this. Yeah. Well, I hate to bust your bubble. First off, I ain't that smart. Um, <laughs> you know, I, I work my tail end off and uh, try to I try to copy what smart smart people do, and that's that's my thing. Well, you know, Rob, I've got five kids. A lot, a lot of people know that, and um, it ain't cheap to have, to raise five kids. First off, and medical insurance not expense is not cheap, and no, it's not right expensive. So when I, you know, I. I left my job to go full-time real estate in 2009. And, um, you know, that was one of the big things that I was nervous about quitting my job was medical insurance. And I hear that so many times where people are like, I want to quit my job, but medical, that's one of the reasons, but, and there's this, but that, and medical is a big one and I get it. Um, but you know, I was like, well, I just got to do, you know, one, yeah, one more deal a year pays for medical. So it wasn't, wasn't going to let that stop me. But that being said, fast forward to, uh, last year and my wife and I went from having, you know, I started in real estate, one kid to last year we had five and, um, my, my insurance policy of blue cross blue shield cost us over $1,400 a month. And with EXP, you know, EXP is essentially, it's a publicly traded company, but we like to say we're agent owned and agent grown because yeah. agents, we're, we're the shareholders here. There's no broker, middleman, franchise, whatever, like we're the ones making the decisions here. So whenever we, we have all of our, you know, our meetings, it's like, what do we want to do here? And our agent said, we want medical insurance. What does that look like? So they went out and they got it done for us and for themselves too. And so last year in November, they launched it and my medical went from 1400 a month to $653 a month is what we pay now oh, with the medical plan. So that's crazy good. Crazy good. good. That's awesome. Good chunk of change. Yeah, good chunk of change. I, I don't think a lot of people really, really understand the benefits of having great insurance. Um, I'm, I'm very fortunate. You know, my family is very fortunate. You know, I, I went 21 years in the military, so now all my insurance is covered. Yeah. But, you know, to have good insurance and be able to rely on that, especially right now, yeah. is crazy. You know, yeah. you know, <clears throat> for me, for instance, you know, going to get testing done or anything like that, that, that can get expensive really quick. Yeah. So. Yeah. so um, all right, so let's talk about stock options. What is this thing about the, the EXP gives you stock options or something like that? Yeah, well, they they're they're stock options, and they just they just they're stock awards. They give you awards and reward you um, in in various number of ways. And I'll tell you, when I joined EXP, it, it was for an additional income stream that I know we're going to talk about. Yeah. But number two. Uh, the, the second most compelling reason for me was the stock. And I'm, you know, I'm a real estate guy and I'm not a stock guy, but if somebody wants to give me some stock, I'm, I'm going to take it. And so me too. You know, <laughs> just like, I'll take it. And that was, and you're about to get some uh, here pretty soon. And uh, from, uh, from our, our friend Wally. Yeah. So whenever they, when I saw it, it was kind of like an icing on the cake kind of deal and and i'll just i'll show you what's happened with me is i joined it's this is my 25th month at exp is we've just finished my my second year yeah. last month and and so they have several ways you can earn stock um one when you first sell your first property each year when your cap resets you sell your first property they're going to give you a couple hundred dollars worth of stock whenever you um sponsor an agent they come in they sell their first property, 
they're going to give you, I think, about $400 worth of stock. Now, whenever you cap every single year, they're going to give you around $400 worth of stock. They have, uh, they also have a, like it's, I guess this is the stock option they have is every time you close a transaction, you do a listing and uh, you earn a commission, you, and this is optional, uh, you can use 5% of your commission to buy stock at a 10% discount. And I do that. That seemed like a no brainer to me. I believe 100% what the company's doing and the, our stock is doing very, very well. Um, although, you know, we can't speculate which direction it's going to go in the future, but it's, it's doing well. Um, and then the last thing that they did, and they, they started this in 2015 or 2016, they created um, the Icon Asian Award. Yeah. And so EXP, we're an 80-20 split with the $16,000 cap. And what they really created was, uh, I call it a loss leader. Um, basically they say, hey, we're going to take a loss to gain this business because it's going to help us in these other ways. And so they create an icon agent award. So if you hit the icon agent status, you're going to, the $16,000 you paid in cap, they're just going to give it back to you in yeah. $16,000 worth of stock. And that really caught my attention. I was like, man, cause I wasn't doing um, any of my listings for, for our properties before I had an agent on staff full time, kind of, we had a flat fee agreement type of thing. Yeah, that and kind of shifted, didn't it? It shifted, you know, and I, and I still have an agent. She's still, it's still an agreement. It's still a, a similar uh, commission structure for me and my agents. It, it's a different agent um, because I wanted that, I wanted that stock and, and the fast forward Rob. So I'm finished up my second year. I'm on the brink of earning 6,000 shares of stock in the company. And when I joined, you know, it was floating around seven or $8 a share. Well, as of yesterday, we're at $31 a share. That's so that's it's pretty good. It's pretty good. That's it's pretty, pretty good. good. And it's kind of like free money. And I'm, I'm just kind of had a like, holy crap kind of moment in the last week or two when our stock, it, stock has been going through the roof. But I'm, I don't know if, it, I don't know anybody out there in investment in real estate anywhere that doesn't like free money. If they didn't have to work very hard for it and they get it. That's, that's, that's a bonus. Well, the thing with, with agents, they're already doing this work somewhere else. You know, maybe they're at, they're at a competing broker there. They may be at a flat fee shop. I used to be, I was a flat fee place for 10 years Yeah. and people are like, you know, why would you leave flat fee? Well, medical, stock and what we're about to talk about and that i uh a friend of our one of the friends uh agents you connected me with the other day you know is flat fee shop and my question my question to flat fee agents now and i say it kind of jokingly but i'm not it's it's like well do you really only want to make 100 percent they're like well what do you mean i'm like well i get it you can keep your flat fee but i would um i would have lost a substantial amount of money uh, if I had stayed, you know, what I was doing. Yeah. Yeah. So. Um, and a lot of people don't know this about a lot of us here at Jet Lending is uh, that, well, hell, 90% of us are real estate agents. You know, that gives us an advantage at Jet Lending over, you know, some other lending companies because, you know, we got a pulse on what the real estate market's doing. We're not just loan officers. We're also you know, investors and, you know, EXP agents. So that's a, that's a great benefit when you're dealing with a lender as well. So let's talk about our favorite thing. And uh, I mean, I'm, I'm excited about this. I know because uh, I just got my first guy and, I, and once you get that first one, you kind of get hungry for the next and the next and the next. And Wally, I mean, he's, he's a great guy and I'm glad he's on our team. Uh, but I want you to tell everybody about the downline and how, how this is an advantage over other companies. Yeah. So, so when EXP, EXP was founded, you gotta understand like EXP was founded by our founders, tech guy as his background was tech and, and lead generation. He worked for Microsoft, worked for AOL in the eighties and nineties. And, and then he went into real estate and he was an agent and a broker for you know close to a decade and so what he really did was he he dissected the 
comp the traditional broker model. And basically he tore it down to nothing and uh, rebuilt the thing, but he rebuilt it from that tech mindset. Uh, he, he took an Amazon approach to real estate. So in a couple of ways, number one, with the, the cloud-based brokerage and basically eliminated the broker, the franchisees from the equation, created tremendous cost savings, hundreds and hundreds of thousands of dollars. And what he did was he said, okay, rather than having all of this overhead, including not only buildings, not only brokers, but, you know, it could be certain, you know, corporate paid recruiters and stuff like that. That could be uh, in times of a down market, or if you, if you're a business owner and you go out and hire five or 600 K, you know, corporate recruiters and they're not good, or some of them are good, then you may not be making money. And we have a sustainability, uh, is one of our core values. We just have that mindset from, from Glenn. He launched this thing in 2009, you know, during the, depths of the recession he launched the launched this brokerage and it was with this mindset to be 100 percent sustainable but he wanted to pay agents more and he wanted to give them ownership we've already talked about how the ownership plays out but he also wanted to pay them more so what what glenn really did the way that i break this down was is that that he compensates us as agents to go out and you know share the benefits of the company and, and what he did is really, it's really what a lot of industries are doing. If you understand how Amazon works, Amazon is really an affiliate based model. So affiliate, uh, Amazon provides a platform for people to, you know, uh, do business, buy and sell, barter, whatnot. And um, they provide that platform. So what eXp has done is basically provided the platform for us to do business, but Glenn knows that brokers lose about a third of their agents every year. You know, your small traditional brokerages, they're on this hamster wheel because they're always losing agents. They spend a, a lot of their time, maybe a majority of their time recruiting. And yeah. that's not really what a broker should be doing. A broker should be teaching, training, educating, reviewing contracts, looking for liabilities, all that type of stuff. So Glenn said, rather than waste all this time or spend all this time, we want to just work on becoming the best brokerage that we can efficient in every single area. If we're good at what we do and we're giving ownership and we're giving additional income streams, we're pretty confident that we're just going to grow. So with this model, what he did, he created a 90, 10 split. I said, we're 80, 20. He created a 90, 10 split and said, we can be very profitable just on a 10% commission but we're going to share that additional revenue 50, 50 with the agents. So you made 80, 20 split that other uh, 50% of corporate revenue goes to us as agents and revenue share. So simple math, Rob, is if whenever you and I sponsor an agent or if one of our agents sponsor an agent, whenever um, one of our agents has a commission, for example, say they sell a $340,000 home, they get a $10,000 commission, 80, 20 split. That agent's going to get eight thousand twenty goes to the broker. Our our revenue share is is based off that big number, the gross revenue. It's three and a, three and a half percent. Uh, so you know you would receive a, a three hundred fifty dollar commission. You know whenever any of your agents on your front line go out and sell a property, and um, you know I am here sitting here twenty four months, twenty five months, and I've got one hundred and twenty one agents in my downline and that's geez i don't even know how many states now i think i'm at the point where i have agents in more states than texas um which is like crazy and uh as of this morning the my rev share you know was was over seven thousand dollars that i'll be making this month uh, just for telling people about the company so when i saw it I, you know first when i saw the model i was like holy crap i don't even is this true is this something going on here and and when i really dove into it i just people don't man, you know, i'm sorry people don't realize how much seven thousand dollars is for doing absolutely nothing yeah it, i mean that's more than a lot of people make you know ever <laughs> and I mean, you're making that basically just for waking up and breathing every yeah, just just for telling it, agents already have to be licensed somewhere. 
So I just have, I really, my job is when I meet agents, run across agents, or now agents in my downline just connect me with people that they know, is really like, I don't have to sell, pitch, promote anything. I just say, you know, are you happy where you're at? Are you, you know, open to look at what we're doing? And what we're doing is giving you some medical benefits, some uh, uh, stock options, stock awards, additional income stream, and, and a multitude of leads. Like we're, once again, a tech-based company founded by a guy who specializes in lead generation. So there are some things that we're doing where statistically our agents are closing a higher percentage of, of deals than any other major brokerage. And that's, that's kind of a, 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 a you know, little secret too that people don't realize is our agents are becoming more efficient yeah. with. Um, well, don't give them too much. That's going to be for our yeah. next time. Yeah, there you go. There you go. <laughs> uh, you want to tease them just a little bit. Yeah, there you go. The next okay. time we, next time we talk about this, I want to go into that a little bit more. Yeah, got it. Man, I, I appreciate the fact that you took some time out of your day. You know, when I say, you know, you're making that money for not really doing anything, it was a lot of hard work goes into it. Cause I mean, you, I know you've talked to several leads that I've given you and, and I appreciate that. I know uh, Alex and everybody at Jet, we appreciate all your hard work to, you know, help us build our, you know, downline as well. And so yeah. I appreciate you taking the time today to, to, to do this and, I mean, you got anything else you want to leave with? Man, that, that's it. Like I said, I don't like to sell anybody on anything. I cover, when I do, when I present this to people, this is my side hustle, you know, it started, right. it, it may turn into my full-time hustle, to be quite honest, the way it's, it's trended. I'm kind of like, holy cow, I didn't, I didn't foresee this. I knew it looked like it was possible. Now it's starting to happen. But um Man, Rob, I don't try to sell anybody on anything. Usually I get to about my second slide. I'm like, look, if, if, the, if you don't like what I'm going to cover in my, my second slide, which I talk about the founder, and then I go over those kind of the pillars that we've talked about, then it's just, it's okay. You know, yeah. but if, if what you've heard, you know, is, is something that interests you, then do what I did. I'm like, you know, I saw, I'm like, I'd probably be kicking myself. I don't take 30, 45 minutes to take, take a look at it. And I did, and I'm glad that I did. And that's, that's it, man. It's just a, it's a, it's a math conversation. It's a business conversation about ways to improve your business, make some more money and have some ownership in the company you're working with. And we know that's how, that's how you create wealth, ownership, additional income streams, saving some money and, and strategic partnerships. Yeah. I'm, I'm the exact same way when I come to uh, talking about clients at Jet Lending. You know, look, I'm not trying to sell you on whether we're the cheapest or whether we're the best. Uh, I'm selling you. I'm selling me. You yeah. get 100% access to me and you get 100% access to our company and what we can provide. You know, you've got access to knowledge that no other lending company out there has. You've got Eddie Gant that looks at every one of your deals. and I sell that all the time. I was yeah. like, this guy's done more deals in Houston than anybody else. Yeah. And if that's not, not uh, if, there, if you can put a price tag on that, please do. And man, mentioning Eddie's name is one of the biggest validations that we have. Now there's some big players coming on, yeah. investors, uh, obviously top agents in the country coming on, but there's some big time investors that now are coming on, you know, Jason and Rob, uh, Jason Bible and Robert coming on and Than Merrill from Fortune Builders. So that validation is tremendous. And the last thing I would say is that we, EXP model is great. It's fabulous. It's wonderful, uh, you know, obviously. But what we're doing with our team, we're treating it like a business for our team. So we've got multiple masterminds each and every week that we have for our agents and agent investors, some focused on revenue share, some focused on lead generation. And then I'm leading one that's just about real estate investing because I know a lot of agents are, wanting to invest are investing and they need help Q and A and stuff like that. So we're, we've got that and some training platforms that we've built out above and beyond um, even what EXP provides that are kind of really catering to our team of agents and our downline that they can plug into. All right. Well, Brad, I know you're a busy man. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let you hop off here again. I know everybody's going to appreciate this knowledge uh, and uh, I appreciate you. Uh, yeah. Guys, this is Brent Phillips, um, EXP, and real estate guru in, here in Houston. Um, appreciate it, and 
Man, I'll, I'll, I'll talk to you soon. All right, Rob, I appreciate you. Thank you. Right. Thanks, guys.